Hmm. Still no sign of the mystery creature. Snakes shed their skin as they grow bigger. The snake that shed this one must be huge, or longer than a gap. <gasps> mm, and that smell must be snake musk. It's a stinky liquid large snakes make. But there shouldn't be any snakes this large in the Everglades. <gasps> the mystery creature! Better call Ranger Marsh. Mm, keep the fish biscuit coming, them is yummy. There are plenty more back at the octopod. We'll see you soon. Ranger Marsh, come in. This is Ranger Marsh. Say again. Ranger Marsh, come in. Uh, we're working fine this morning. Then let me try. Dashy, this is Captain Barnacles. Do you read me? Loud and clear, Captain. You better come quick. I think we may have a lead on the mystery creature. We'll be right there. Yow! Just what I was afraid of. This skin came from a Burmese python. Jumping jellyfish. Burmese pythons will eat anything they can fit in their mouths. And they can open their mouths very wide. Mm, this one is a female by the looks of the scales. A female? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Tweet, what do you hear? Eggs. Python eggs, freshly hatched. But where are the baby snakes? Hi. All I see are eggs. Oh, hello there. Of course. Some snakes like to hide in their shells for a few days after hatching. Looks like we got here just in time. Sure did. If these little fellers slithered into the swamp, pretty soon the whole Everglades would be crawling with huge, hungry snakes. And that storm's almost here. We'd better get these eggs to safety before any fires break out. Wait, we found the Burmese python eggs, but where's the mummy python? <gasps> she was right here. That is a big snake. She was so quiet, I never heard her coming. Now, drop those eggs. You and your eggs are in great danger. If lightning strikes... I don't know what you are, but nobody messes with my nest. Looks like they're all napping, Captain. <gasps> Phil's footprints. It'll take too long to go around. We need to sneak past the gators without them noticing us. But look at all that gloopy mud. We'll be up to our necks. Then we'll just have to make ourselves a little taller. No wonder flamingos have such long legs. Aye, that makes walking through the swamp easy as pirate pie. So that's what my granddad calls kelp and lima beans on toast. Was he? Shh. <sighs> Mm. Oh, that was a close one. Look, another feather. Phil must be close. Come on. There's something up ahead. I hope it's not another gator. By the sound of it, I'd say it's... <laughs> Easy, Phil. It's only us. Oh, phew. Hey, guys. Ah, what are you doing out here, matey? Your mum's worried sick. Uh, I was just practicing my flamingo dance, and I was getting really good. But then I got a little lost and muddy and hungry. It's dangerous for you to be out here all by yourself, Phil. Come on, time to head home. Aye, before we're spotted by any more of those big green... Oh, oh, gators! Muddy flamingos, my favorite. Phil, ah. wait. That way leads back towards the gator. Yes. Muddy flamingos. And muddy 
whatever those things are. Uh oh. This way. They're gaining on us. Don't worry, guys. I got this one. Yeah. Zag, Zag. Do you really think this is the time for dancing, matey? Just do what I do. Zig, Zag, Zig. 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 It's working. See, I told you I was getting the hang of it. Zig, Zag, Zig. Just a little further. Zigzag jump! <laughs> Sorry, gators. No muddy flamingos or octonauts on the menu tonight. You need to stop Ernesto. There's a fungus in this stream that could make him sick. We'd better keep an eye out for Ernesto before he gets too close to the stream. Already after him. Hello. Oh, have you spotted Ernesto? No, this is a call for help. <laughs> Don't worry. I've got this. Ah, Ernesto, please stop. It's too dangerous. Who do you mean delicious? Do not worry, Bunny. Trout only eat frogs' eggs. I am much too big to fit in their mouths. <gasps> but not too big to fit into that coral snake's mouth. Uh -oh. Vamoose! What a frog. Now there is a rare delicacy. <laughs> Disappointing. Perhaps this fish biscuit will make up for that. Mmm, tasty. Gracias, Bunny. Now you will take me to my new family. I'm afraid the water in your cousin's stream will only make you sick, mi amigo. But I have waited so long to meet them. I know, but don't worry. They're not going anywhere. <laughs> <laughs> Got you. Oh. So sorry to drop in, Dashi. Are those my... <laughs> mis primos, mis amigos. Amazing rescue. Is everyone all right? We are fine, Senor Pedro. I only wish we were not separated from our new cousin. I have waited ten years not to be alone. What is a few more days? Splashing news, my friends. Your stream is clean and free of fungus. And so are the water frogs. <laughs> Does that mean? It's time to welcome your new family into their new home. It is a very nice home, Ernesto. It is even nicer with company. Amazing. They never even knew each other existed before. And now it's like they've known each other all their lives. Kind of like when I met you guys. <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> oh, we're glad we found you too, Barney. <laughs> Sorry, Katie. My eggs! <laughs> Two hearts! Ooh. Oh, don't worry, ma'am. We'll get your eggs back. You need to get yourself back in the water to stay cool. Let's go! Hi! You'll want to stay near the water and protect your other eggs. Speaking of which, where's Ronnie and Donnie? Get away! <laughs> Ronnie. What? They weren't using those eggs. There they are. Huh? Where'd they go? 
Give them back. Those eggs don't belong to you. That was much easier than I thought it would be. Man, hard to believe they just ran away. I'm not sure they were running from you. Lonnie, what are you doing up there? Keeping away from them. Looky here. Exotic food. Ooh, fancy and tasty. Ooh. Esteban, nobody messes with our friends. Why not, Ronnie? Shh, Lonnie, back me up here. Okay. Listen to their adorable little hiss. What you gonna do? Spit at us? <sighs> Smart. You will stay away from my whipping tail. Fine. Forget it. We'll find food elsewhere. Oh, you boys did real good. <laughs> yeah. How did we know how to do that? Because that's what Nile monitor lizards do. You're used to defending yourselves from lions. Hmm. I reckon you fellas are gonna be all right. Especially if you stick together. I told you, everything was fine. Hey, this place? Maybe not so bad. Nothing here we can't handle. Of course, you're all back where you belong. Now, let's get these eggs back where they belong. Oh, do we have to? <laughs> so, those silly monitor lizards managed to fit in after all. Yep, I should have known I couldn't stop them fellers from getting into trouble in their new home. But I sure feel better knowing they can get themselves out of it just fine. <laughs> to the Octoray. Wow, look at that. I'm Captain Barnacles. I like to go with the flow. Above and beyond. <laughs> <laughs>